has happened since I installed this hair okay so where do we begin the hair this is my official update last update of my Yvonne kinky curly hair I've had the hair for oh gosh since like May and I installed it maybe like three months ago so yeah i've had this hair for quite a while i have not worn it the entire time let's just make that clear i have not worn the hair the entire time i actually when i the last time i made the video i wore the hair for like a few weeks then i took it out and i actually got box braids and i wore those for a little while and then i went on vacation as i stated in my previous video this was my vacation hair so yes i wore it on vacation and i will get into that in a second okay all right so first we're gonna start off I actually cut the hair shorter as you can see the hair came down to about here when it was curly but I cut it shorter just cuz my neck was getting hot and mm -mm. so I cut it shorter and I also colored the hair like I mentioned in the previous video I am going to explain that in a second as well so I just want to talk about the hair and the integrity of the hair and everything like that so the hair is actually still really bomb. Um, even through everything I've put it through, it still looks good. So I'm completely pleased with the hair and how long it's lasted me. I still get tons of compliments daily whenever I wear this hair. Is it your hair? How do I get my hair to grow like that? How do you get it to look like this? So yes, I'd be wanting to tell them, yeah, it's my hair, but no. I won't lie. I'll just say, you know, it's not mine, but... I can tell you where to get the hair, of course, but yes. Yeah, so the hair still looks good after all this time. So let's get into the coloring. I wanted to color the hair like I stated because I just didn't want to keep it black. My hair, my natural hair isn't even black. Um, I just like color. I feel like color brightens up my face. So I decided let me just go ahead and color the hair um, by myself, of course, because I do everything on my own. So I decided to color the hair and I lifted the hair with bleach first. Um, not, I didn't want to go blonde with it. I just wanted to lift it a tad just so when I put the color on top that it would actually show. So I lifted the hair a little bit and then I put L'Oreal High Colors Copper on top. And this is the result that I got. It didn't come out as bright as I wanted to, but honestly, I'm okay with the color. I still get confidence on the color. So I was like, you know what? I'm just going to leave it. I'm not going to go through the process again or anything. I'm just going to leave it. So I left it alone, and this is what I got. Let me know if you guys like the color. Um, it's just going to have to do. <laughs> I'm not coloring it again. I don't want to ruin it anymore. I don't want to go through that process again at all. The closure held up great. It's, it still looks pretty good. People, honestly, I, the people like, I thought that was all your hair. And I'm like, no, none of my hair is left out. So kudos to me. I guess I did a really good job on the closure. What else do I want to talk about? Oh, my vacation. Okay, so as I mentioned, this was my vacation hair. And I went away to, I went on a cruise with my family, which was so fun. And I wore this hair, of course. And let's just say that this hair does not mix well with salt water. Um, Osho, none of that stuff. This hair, I got in the water, and I, I didn't plan on deep sea diving in the first place, but I was in the water, and I was like, let me go a little deeper, and got the bottom of the hair wet, just a tad, and let me tell you, it was a struggle and a half trying to detangle. I think something in the salt water just does not agree with this hair. I mean, I got it detangled, of course. I just used conditioner and water. But it was just, I didn't want to have to go through that. It was a, a long little process trying to detangle. I detangled in small sections, but no. Do not mix this hair with salt water. <laughs> just an FYI, if you're going anywhere with salt water, don't deep sea dive with this hair. Because you will be 
overwhelmed with the detangling. But yeah, the hair detangled perfectly fine, but it just was a long process and I was just not here for it. I mean, other than that, everything is A-OK -okay with this hair. This hair held up great. Um, it still looks good. I still get tons of compliments. So, I mean, that means the hair is still doing good. But yeah, that's really all I have to say about the hair. If you have any other questions, please let me know. This will be my last update on this hair just because... It's getting colder in Chicago, and I just want to, you know, I haven't worn my hair out in forever. People that know me are like, when are you going to wear your natural hair? And I'm like, I'm protective styling, duh. They don't really understand the whole protective styling situation, but yeah, my hair actually grows better when I have it put away. And most people don't understand that, but it's just how my hair is. But yeah, I'm going to stop wearing wigs, stop wearing braids and stuff just for a little while I'm gonna style my own hair because it's been super long and I miss styling my hair I guess you could say but yeah so that's really it if you have any other questions I don't think I forgot anything I just wanted to come on here really quick because I know I left y'all hanging big time like I've gotten tons of like where are you what's up with the hair you never told us about the color and this and that and this is what I'm here to do so yes this is my official update, last update of my Yvonne Brazilian Kinky Curly Hair. And I will leave the links down below if you want to get the hair as well to also the closure that I got in hair. Yeah, everything's still A-OK. -okay, so go ahead and get you some hair. I still love the hair. All right, guys. Thanks so much for watching, and I will see you in my next one. Bye, y'all.